Hi YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Today I thought I would give you, show you rather, my Brahmin collection. It's not very large. You guys know I just started purchasing Brahmin. Um, so I'm going to try to go in order, but to be honest, I ordered them all within like days or weeks of each other. So I might get a little bit out of sync. Some of them I've shared and some of them I haven't shared. But you'll see them here. And I just want to show you my silhouettes and then what particular silhouette is my favorite. Okay, so let's just jump in. My first item that I purchased, and I purchased this item a while back. And then when I say a while back, I may have I probably have had this particular item almost a year. Not quite sure. I haven't shared it on my page, but I do think I posted a I post a picture of it on my Instagram not sure about my community page but this is the Brahmin what is this heartbreaker Chelsea backpack so it is in a beautiful red can you see that it has the Brahmin logo right there in gold gold zipper with the red trim I have this Eiffel Tower charm that I leave on here because that's what I use on it and then it has a pocket right here and inside the pocket the pocket is a large pocket can y'all see that it's a large pocket this is what the side of the backpack looks like this is the back there is a back pocket here but if you notice I have one of the straps tucked in there because I wear it over my shoulder with one strap so I just kind of throw it over my shoulder and wear it like that. Here's the other side and here is the bottom. Let me show you the inside. Again, this backpack is called the Chelsea. Sorry about the noise. And you always get a, a, a dress, you know, a dust bag with them. But here's what the inside looks like. So you do have a pocket here. It's a slip pocket, slip pocket. And you have your key keeper here, right there. And the key keeper is gold, it's on the red leather trim. On this side, you do have a zippered pocket. And here's what the zipper pull looks like. Let me see. Y'all see that? Okay. And then that's just the inside of it. Y'all see that? Let me see if I can give y'all some better lighting. Hold on. There you go. Can you see that? So this was my first item that I bought. And when I bought it, I was like, "Ooh, this is stiff. And as I read up on it, y'all, look here. I knew something was in this pocket. I've been looking for this safety tool for a minute. And it's been in this backpack. I was wondering what had this flopping. But here is the tag. If you're interested, it's the Chelsea Heartbreaker Melbourne backpack. And y'all, when I purchased this, I also purchased the matching wallet. And I love it. This is the Andy wallet that I have shown. You'll see by the end of this video, I have several of these. It has this Brahmin logo here. Again, I haven't shown this in a video on my channel yet. Y'all see that? And it opens like so. You have your, I think it's six card holders here and your ID window. And let me see. Yeah, six card holders here. And you have a slot here. You also have a slot here. And you have a slot here. So nice petite wallet. Snap closure. I love this style of wallet um, from Brahmin. So this is my first item. And y'all, I have I moved in it to carry one time. And then I had to change for some reason. And I moved right out. So I honestly haven't carried this. But maybe a day. That's all I've carried it. And when I purchased it, the stiffness is what was getting me. But after that first day, I could I even start to feel a difference. But it does have, you know, that stiff feeling. It's not super hard but it is stiff it's stiff 
so I guess over time it will soften up but y'all I don't wear it that often so I don't know how long it would take to soften up for me I'm sorry this is what the top handle looks like can y'all see that it's just like a grab you can grab it here and carry it and I just love 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 of the color so that's my first item it was a backpack yeah, I'm just really not a backpack person. Let me move my bag I'm in so I can have some space. Well, I'll push it back. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'll push it back. Okay, so that's my first one. Now, I don't remember. I think I purchased this next. And this is my cilia. I do have a video on this one. This is the bag that I fell in love with that drew me to Brahmin first. I saw a YouTuber named Chantel R., she had this bag in the pecan Melbourne, that pretty brown, and I just loved it. I loved it. I loved it. And I went on a hunt for it, and I could never find it. And then when I found it, it was in a bag called Elise, if I'm not mistaken, E-L-I-S-E. And the Elise looked a little bit taller right here. So I didn't, point, you know, I didn't bite the bullet on that one. I waited a while, and then I decided to look, and I fell in love with this color here. And it was in the cilia. All they had was the cilia. All they had was this one and the brown one. So if I come up close, you'll see this has a lot of blue in it. A lot of light blue. I wear a lot of denim. So it has blue and gold hues in it. I have my charm. I just keep that on there. That charm was made by Carmen Hawkins here on YouTube. It says queen. It just fits perfectly. This is what the bag looks like from the front. I love the pleating. I love this silhouette. It reminds me of the Christie, the Coach Christie, and the Coach Elaine. Uh, what is it? Laney. Look, what is it? You know, it's another one that's made just like the Christie, but it's a little shorter. But it reminds me of the Christie, and you'll see why in a minute. Here is the side of the bag. Here is the back. This silhouette does not have a back pocket. Okay. You have your pleating, and then this is the other side. Notice there is a strap that comes with it, and I did adjust the strap. Is this one I adjusted? Wait a minute, y'all. Let me don't want to tell you wrong. No, I didn't have to adjust this one. I adjusted another one. I'll show it to you. But I leave the strap on there in case I want to be hands-free. But, guys, I can put this over my shoulder as well. This is what the handles look like. And I don't know if you can see how tall that hole is right there but I can slide this over my shoulder if I need to it, it will fit right under my arm it does have the Brahmin um, charm on it that has Brahmin on both sides and I love this silhouette now you can hear it it is stiff but it feels just like the backpack and so I know over time this will get softer let me show you what the inside looks like so it has a turn lock closure right there, and you can see Brahmin is right there. Brahmin has very nice hardware. To be honest with you, Brahmin is on everything. You'll see it at the top of this hardware right here. It's on that hardware everywhere. Okay? So when you open it, this is what it looks like on the inside. So whereas the Christie has a wider selection or section right here, you just have that slip pocket that normally y'all know I don't like. But I like it in here because it stays flat. It doesn't spill over into the real estate of these two sections. So you can see you have a zipper pocket here. Y'all know something? Wait a minute. I don't think... Let me just check something right quick on this backpack. Oh, I did miss it. Mostly all of Brahmin bags have a pen holder. So this little pocket right here is a pen holder and I forgot to show you that it's on it's on all of my bags so I'm assuming that's a standard so in here you have this zipper pocket right here a very large zipper pocket in here I just have the care sheets here is the tag on it this is the cilia in blue haze Melbourne there you go okay and all of mine were purchased from Brahmin. You can always find Brahmin on Belts and Dillard's and those um, different sites. And normally you can get better prices. So this little pocket right here is called the Jewelry Pocket. 
I use it for you like my bag charms, um, you know that little pouch that I keep of me and Jayla's hair lock. Then you have a, sl a little slot right here, a little pocket right here and a pocket right here. And then you have that pen holder right here on the side of this pocket right here. So it's right there. Can you see that? You have a pen holder. And the interior on all Brahmins have Brahmin all on it. Can you see that? And this is what it looks like. Now, I love this silhouette. This bag is fairly large, um, but I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. The zipper pocket in the middle is trimmed with that leather, and then it's just a nice pocket. It does go all the way to the bottom, but it's not. It's attached to the bottom, so nothing can slide underneath that pocket, okay? And this is a cilia. So this is what drew me to it. And, of course... I purchased um, a matching wallet. Now this is not the Andy wallet. I'm going to have to look at the tag to tell you what it is. But I love it. Look at the hues. You see how all that blue that's in there? I love it. Y'all, this is so cute. I had this bag on with like a denim um, dress. It was like the dress that's short in the front. Kind of drops down. It's above the knee in the front. and Kind of drops down lower in the back. And I had this bag on, y'all with some sandals you couldn't tell me nothing nothing here is a zipper pull on the back okay and the way this wallet works is it opens up and it folds out so it looks like this now the unique thing about this wallet is just one two three four five six seven card holders here plus the id window that makes eight right here and then you have six down here you have your slot right here. You have a slot right there. There's a tag. And then you have a compartment here for your bills. Now this compartment goes all the way down to the bottom. So if there were some things you wanted to keep down there like receipts or whatever you could. Or your stash, you know, your secret stash of cash. You could put it down there. So that is how this wallet is made. Let me see what it's called. This is the Cordelia. Cordelia wallet in the Blue Haze Melbourne. And here is a tag. And I love it. I, I'm a full size chick. You know, I like a full size wallet. I'm trying to downsize. The wallet does have two adjustments here. So you have two snaps. So depending upon how much you carry. As to which one you would use. It's still not a bulky wallet. Can y'all see? So it's still not a bulky wallet. There we go. And that's what it looks like. Okay. So that's the cilia. Alright. And I can tell already I'm not going to be able to get everything in frame. So I hope you guys remember everything. That is that. Matter of fact. I'm going to go ahead and throw the wallet in here. Because you guys have already seen it. And I kind of keep them stored in there. Because I don't typically use them with any of my other bags. Okay. I think the next bag I got was this bag. And this is the Fiora in my favorite color. Woohoo! Look at that deep purple. Yes, look. It has a turn lock closure. Brahmin is there. You have your charm here. Can y'all see that? On both sides. Yeah. So this silhouette was influenced by Dazzle Me 77. You do have your back pocket here. The hardware is gold. And here is the bottom. This bottom has an edge that goes around it. So this part doesn't actually sit on anything when you sit it down. It's a lip here, if y'all can tell. Right there, that goes around. Y'all, this bag is so cute to me. And the straps, here are the straps that I was telling you were, are adjustable. So you do have these holes here. I don't know if y'all can see them right there. That if you wanted to adjust the straps, you could. It was comfortable to me where it was. And y'all, this is a comfortable bag. Brahmin is even on the back of the hardware. As you can see right there. And you have this turn lock closure. And when you open it, you have the same type of silhouette that's in the cilia. This little slip pocket here. You have your zipper pocket back there. And then on this side, you have 
a jewelry pocket right here and then you have your two slots and your pen holder right here and this is what it looks like now this bag I didn't get the matching wallet but I bought a wallet that would coordinate with it because I wanted to give it a pop of color this is another Andy wallet I think it is so pretty go hardware just like the others can I see that y'all I didn't even take the look the plastic is still on there sweet Jesus y'all I don't care this bag but I don't use this back pocket because I normally don't carry a lot of change and I guess that's why the plastic was still on there but I just took it off look at there really nice very beautiful and when you open it this is what you see same setup six card holders one ID window six card slots down here with this flap here flap there and a flap there let me see what this color is called this is the Andy Wallet and Barry Perry Auburn Melbourne can you see that there we go so I love it this silhouette is I really like it but it's tight now this one is the one that gets me the most because it's very structured and I think that's the one I this one I really need to get soft this one I can carry and comfortable no problem but this one right here I want it to soften up because it's really stiff so I do it like this a lot when I'm just sitting sometimes I go back there and get it pull it out and do like that so it can get somewhere because I change bags so often it'll take it a long time to soften up if I don't do that so this one is when I say comfortable comfortable and look at that color alright so that is the Fiora okay now wait a minute my it's I'm trying to get more space so I can move this stuff out alright let's go to the next one push this back there we go all right, and then I think, I don't know, y'all. Anyway, I'll go here. This is my tote. And look at that color. I do have a video on this one. This one came with this little tassel and the charm on a actual charm holder hook. You see that? Really nice. Same gold Brahmin. Of course, y'all know I have my charm on here by Charm by Carmen. This is the one that has Queen on it. It's just flipped over. Let me turn it over so you can see. There we go. It has Queen going down. I carried pinks in it the last time I used it. And I just love it. Look at the hints of gold metallic all throughout that. Y'all so pretty. Here is the side. Here is the back. You do have that back pocket. There's the other side. And y'all here is the bottom. This one actually has feet. So you have four feet here. Because it doesn't have that lip that the Fiora has. So you actually have feet. Did the cilia have feet? Did I show y'all? The cilia has feet too. So when it doesn't have that lip, I see it has four feet on it. Sorry guys, I can't remember if I showed you that or not. But this is, I don't know, what the, I'll look at the tag and see what this is called. Oh, this is the medium asher. That's what this is called. So there's a large one. This is the medium one. And so here is the inside, and I still have my things in there. This is what it looks like. I love this tote. You see how wide that opening is? Y'all see Brahmin all on the lining. Here is that zipper pocket in here. Let me see if I have a tag. I do. Medium Asher and Midnight Melbourne. Y'all see it? Come on, camera. There we go. Okay. So it has that zipper pocket right here and then on this side you have your jewelry pocket your two slots here and your pen holder here this is a perfect size tote for me I love it love it I don't have any cons or anything about it the last time I carried it if you remember I had this pouch in there with the matching wallet and this is another Andy wallet y'all can tell it's my favorite I'm forgetting one bag. It's another bag that came in here before these. Y'all just thought about it. But here we go. 
Here's a Brahmin Gold label. I love how the gold metallic specks are all throughout this wallet. Zipper pool again. Snap closure again. Same setup. Six card holders here. Your um, ID window, which makes seven. Six down here. Your slot here. Your slot here. And your slot here. Here is the tag for the wallet. So Andy Wallet in Midnight Melbourne. Okay, let me put these tags back. Oh, this is the tag for my backpack in here. This is it. Hold on, y'all. Wait, I'm doing stuff. Wait a minute. Let me get my stuff together. That's a wallet. This is... That's a wallet. What we got? Heartbreak. Heartbreak. That goes over there with the red. This is a tag for the wallet. I don't know how I did that. Okay. So this is the Medium Asher. Perfect size tote for me these days. Okay. I'm just going to sit that right there. And then I don't, I haven't shared this. I did show a picture of it, I think, on my community page, but I have not done a video on it. This is my Margo. Love it. Ooh, hoo. When I say I love it, I love it. And you can see my twin made me this charm for it. Charmed by Carmen on IG or Carmen Hawkins here on YT. And I love it. Oh, when I say I love this bag, I love this bag, y'all. This is a great weekend carry travel it does have this back pocket here and the pockets on the back of all my brahmas do fit uh, my iphone 14 pro max does fit it does not have feet because it's a crossbody that's what it looks like on the side y'all the capacity that this bag carries is amazing it has this long crossbody strap and it's flat it is adjustable so you do have your holes here where you can adjust it. Y'all, this bag is so cute. Um, all of the straps on the bags are flat, except for the cilia. Can I see that? The cilia had these rolled handles, and then it has a flat strap, okay? So on the inside of this one, you push it up and it pops open so you have this little clip right here you just push it up and it pops open y'all look at the space in this baby right here look here Woohoo! when i tell you y'all listen i can just about get everything in here i just changed my pouches to smaller pouches this is a great carry you have let me show you you have the zipper pocket here let's see if i have the tag in here i do so this is called the Margot in Pink Cosmo. That's it. Again, I have not done a video on this. I just showed you a picture in my community page. I need to do a video because I do have several requests. So ladies, I will do a what's in my bag in this um, shortly. I haven't forgot you. I saw it. I saw your request and I'll do it for you. But you have this back zipper. You have this opening. Then you have this middle compartment. See how Brahmin has standard... A standard setup and then on this side you have a slip pocket here and then you have this opening y'all when I tell you you can get a lot in this bag y'all I'm telling you look at the opening you can get a lot in this bag I was so surprised I have used this several times I can't even count how many times I've used this bag I typically use it on the weekend and I take it with me when I travel it's just that cute and then I purchased this brick now, this was not found on Brahmin. Everything else came from Brahmin. I actually found this on eBay because I couldn't find it on the site. And it's a, what I'm going to use as a wallet. This is actually what I'm going to use as a wallet. See how wide that opening is? So I can put all my cards and cash in here. It has a little hook. And then it has a gold zipper. It's so pretty. Here's the back. And the sides see how thick it is y'all it's so pretty and there's the front again so this is what I will be using as a wallet inside of this now I have one con with this bag I wish Brahmin had gave it a top handle because when I'm getting in and out the car I don't have anything to grab so I typically have to grab it like this 
to get out the car and then I throw it across my body and I'm good but I would have loved to have a handle on top of this like one of those little small handles like the backpack has on this would have been great that's the only con with this one this is just when I say y'all this one yes ma'am okay and then my last one so I have a total of six is my Duxbury so this is the large Duxbury I do have a video on this one and I have to look up that color y'all but y'all see I still have my leather flower on here in the bronze you do have your charm here just like the rest always double sided this is a beautiful neutral color y'all I love it you have Brahmin down there now I will tell you when well, first this is on the sides it does come with a strap that's inside. This is the back. This one has several eyes. There's an eye here. There's an eye here. And I thought there was an eye on the bottom. It is right there. There's an eye there. You see it has feet. You do have that back pocket that will hold your phone. Go hardware. Now guys, the thing about this one, this is the softest one. This one is so soft. Like look. I don't know why they're all made out of the same thing but this one is super soft out of all of them as a matter of fact when you sit it down look okay you see how you can do that right there if you get my tote you can't do that you see it's like it has a structure see right there you can't do that you can't do that this one has a lip on it let me see the cilia well, you can move this a little bit, but nothing like this Duxbury. This Duxbury is just soft. You see? So, let me show you the inside. It has a gold zipper. There's a zipper pull. And the inside is amazing. Look at that wide opening. Y'all, this wide opening is everything. Okay? What drew me to this bag, I'll show it to you in a minute, but you have the same standard. You have the two pockets here. You have your pen pocket. This is a wide opening like a tote, okay? You have this zipper pocket back here. You do not have a jewelry pocket on it. That little short, small zipper, you don't have that on here. Let me show you the tag. So this is the large Duxbury satchel. And this is in Dune Lakeway. I don't think they have this color anymore. This was an exclusive one that I almost missed. When I saw it, it was this baby right here that got me, y'all. This right here? This strap sold me on that bag. It just, oh my goodness. It, it just added so much class to it. It actually has a D-ring on it where you can put your charm on it and have it hanging on the shoulder. I love how that leather is at the bottom. The hardware is amazing. So, y'all, that, that bag is everything. This is the wallet I chose to get with it. It's not the matching wallet. Again, I don't like to do matchy-matchy on everything. Sometimes I want it to just kind of flow. Actually... I didn't have a choice. I don't think they had a matching wallet in this color. So I just went on the site to find something that I thought would blend well. And this is what I came up with. It's another Andy wallet. Y'all see why it's my favorite? But look at that coloring. Y'all. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, here is the back. Same setup. Y'all know the Andy wallet. Y'all can tell it's my favorite, right? They do have other wallets, y'all. I, I just like the Andy wallet. Six card holders, ID window, six card holders, your flap here, your flap here, and your flap here. I think I'm about to run out of time and I'm going to have to pause. Here is the card for it. Okay. It's the Andy Wallet in Bluestone Ombre Mini Melbourne. Can y'all see that? So, okay, let me, get, let me get it to come back in. Hold on. There we go. Y'all, this wallet is pretty, okay? Absolutely gorgeous, okay? Y'all take it in. Y'all take that in. What? Look, look. Take it in. 
beautiful 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 so that is my collection my little small collection of Brahmins that I have now do you want to know what my favorite silhouette is can you guess what my favorite silhouette is you need a minute huh y'all my absolute favorite silhouette is this baby right here <laughs> My Duxbury, this large Duxbury. Now, I did order the small one. This, this one comes in two sizes, y'all. So, when it says Duxbury Satchel, that's the small one. If it says large Duxbury Satchel, that's this. It has to have the word large in front of it. I did order the small in a beautiful blue color, but I just felt like it was too small for me for my everyday carry. I could have used it like on the weekends. Or just weeks where I don't have things going on. But on my regular routine, my regular schedule, this worked so good for me. It was hard to move out of this bag. So, yes, this is my favorite. The Duxbury. Okay? In the large. Alright, guys. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. I am loving my Brahmins. I will go ahead and tell you. Let me just go ahead and tell you what my second one is. Oh, that might be hard though. Hold on, y'all. Let me put this stuff back in here. Hold on. I like to keep them stuffed. I don't know if this came out of here. I don't know where my dust bag is for this one. Okay, hold on. I figured out afterwards. So this is my favorite, right? Y'all see the handles are rolled. Okay. So the dust bear is my favorite. And I think my next favorite. Huh. I don't know, y'all. I really don't know. I like them all. <laughs> I like them all. Um, it's going to be between the tote and the cilia. So it's going to be between these two as to my next favorite. I love the carefreeness of this tote. The open mouth and how well it carries. This one, so I probably would say the tote is my next favorite. So probably the tote and then the cilia. Okay. And then the, um, what's this? Fiora. But I like them all. Don't get me wrong. I love them all. I, I've used them all because if I didn't like them, I was going to take it back. And you see, this is these are my keepers. So that is my collection of my Brahmins, y'all. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have, if you are a Brahmanista, you know. Um, or if you have dabbled in with Brahmin and you're loving it, your feelings about it. A lot of people feel like these bags are, you know, too dressy. But y'all, when you put this, let me tell you. When I put this baby on right here. And I posted a picture of some sneakers that I got with it. Baby, that is it. Get you a Brahmin. Prop it up with some sneakers that match. Baby boo. Baby boo. Baby boo. Okay. And even sandals, though. I like them with sandals and sneakers. Sneakers is a new thing for me, y'all. I wasn't into sneakers. My daughter always wanted me to get into sneakers. And I have purchased quite a bit of sneakers since she left here. But, y'all, they're comfortable and they look amazing when you have a bra man on your arm. Okay? So, there you go, guys. That is it. I hope you enjoyed the video. And until the next time, be blessed.